Gold and Fork from Northern Ireland, sponsored by Invest Northern Ireland, is Barons Court Estate for Wild Sika Venison Loin. How are you doing? Fantastic. This is marvellous. Congratulations. Here's your gone. Hell of a handshake. I think I've just broken a knuckle. Uh, well done. Here we go. Now, uh, obviously, uh, they've been on the estate for a long time, originally from Asia, of a seeker. But uh, first introduced onto Baron's Court, I mean, long before the and me arrived. So around the 1700s, um, and they were in various different sort of big deer parks up on the hill. Um, very sadly, as a result of World War I, um, and a number of different storms afterwards, the enclosures fell over and the deer went out and they ever since have really been wild. So the deer, the herd is around 700 and it's fully wild. So in order for us to actually produce the food, um, we have to go out and cull the deer and then process the deer. Um, so it's very, very labor intensive. It takes roughly 22 hours to stalk a deer um, in, t in, in total. Um, I must say, I don't, haven't really prepared a speech because I had no expectation of winning this. So Do bloody well, kid. Don't worry about it. We're just absolutely thrilled. So thank you very, very much. It's all right, Jamie. I've got to ask you, why Seeker, for you, preference over red, row or fallow? It's a very good question. Seeker, basically, because they're more of a woodland-type deer, they have a far greater variety of food. Um, so basically, sort of red deer are mainly sort of nowadays renowned for up to on the sort of the moorland or the heather area, whereas basically where we are is basically in a more sort of very fertile um, grass-based area. I do send our best to all the butchers, the keepers, everyone who's involved with this. I know it's a great team, but Baron's Court, well done. It's a bloody tasty. And that, that seeker did not die in vain. That's a fantastic loin. Well done. Well, thank, thank you very much indeed. Thank you.